good afternoon friends yeah now i have got another book and the book name is political theory which i told you yesterday also that i am going to have political theory and introduction and my chapter chapter is political theory and introduction right you just tell me you just think about it for one one second or two seconds what the quality a human being is having what a quality a human being is having okay i read for the first paragraph then you will be able to write uh, you will be able to you know uh, able to digest that what a what a human being is basically and at the uh, at the, your margin you can write down also here only in the margin you can write down what are the qualities first of all we will study <coughs> we will discuss then you write down i will give you the points also human being are unique in two respects they possess reason and the ability to reflect on their actions this is the point number 1 that is they possess reason unko reason jan jan sakte kyu hua kaise hua kahan hua kya karan tha what are the causes what are the consequences any reason related incident they can put the reason and after that reason what the action could be for example if you don't study what are what are the reasons any reason could be what then what will be the action you got it now now you are it's very clear for you they also have the capacity to use language you know when we talk to each other we are communicating right so a, a person is having is a he is a communicative genius communicative so who kuch bhi karta hai to communication karta you need a glass of water you can ask anyone at your home you need a glass of water you need something else you can get you are talking to a friend you can communicate with your friend so that's the communicate with each other unlike other species they can express their innermost thought innermost thought so basically other species cannot uh, you know express their innermost aapke andar ki jo bhavna hai you cannot share with uh, they cannot share with others but yes a human being can share if you are feeling you know uh, you are feeling sad if you are feeling good your uh, whatever your feelings are suppose somebody somebody is not good to you yes you can share to him whatever you feel are you can express your pain in your most thoughts you can express you want to what you want to be in the future you can you can even discuss with yourself with other species cannot they can share the ideas and discuss they can share the ideas and discuss what they consider to be good and desire i told you this particle theory has its roots in the twin aspects of his human and self particle theory the particle theory hum pad rahe hain ki do hisson mein human being and self human being jitne bhi human being you are a human being another people is a man is a human being many people are human being that every basically jo insaan hai that he is a human and another aspect is a very unique thing that yourself you are individual aap individual ho aap apne aap se bhi communicate kar sakte ho aap jaise na ek insaan mann mann mein baatein kar raha hai apne baatein nahi kar raha wo apne aap se communicate kar raha hai you can talk to yourself also no Many times you talk to yourself. Suppose you are alone, nobody is nearby you, and you start to talking to yourself. You feel that it is a enjoyable action, right? So it analyzes certain basic questions such as how should society be organized. Certain questions which are minor, but yes, society is still. 
हम सोसाइटी के लिए हैं सोसाइटी हमारे सोसाइटी बनी तो बनी जैसे सोसाइटी में इतना इंडिफरेंस क्यों है तो सोसाइटी इतना स्टैग्नेटेड क्यों है राइट सोसाइटी में इतने इतने यू नो जहाँ वाइज दे वर सो मच यू नो डिफरेंसेस इन बिटवीन द हैव एंड हैव नॉट डिस्क्रिमिन वाइज दे आर सो मच डिस्क्रिमिनेशन इन द सोसाइटी यू आर सो मेनी थिंग्स अबाउट द सोसाइटी एंड देन यू नो वी आर ऑल इन इंडिपेंडेंट कंट्री नाउ इफ मैक्सिमम कंट्रीज ऑल द कंट्रीज आई मस्ट दे आर इंडिपेंडेंट independent in india their political setup suppose you know india is a democratic country today i will have this introduction with you and some part of here to so slow and suddenly i will pick up the right so suppose you are you are in a democratic country right and just nearby your myanmar is having dictatorship pakistan was having dictatorship even bangladesh was having dictatorship china is a one, one party system same communist party one party people can have, people can be differ but party is only one a, a part of dictatorship you can say by the party but india is a multi party so here you can think about the positive point also and of the multi party system the negative point also of the multi party system. you can say you can ask it is the kitna corruption ho chuka hai ek baar even you say yourself also how much corruption is that in india population is increasing day by day no job scarcity is very much there Pop- pollution is there right and you know degradation of the degradation of the environment is there right many problems are there many problems then you suppose you think why we are uh, in discipline is there in discipline then you think yeah why we are following democratic setup here kya problem hai kyun nahi democratic setup ko khatam kar dete expression your expression this could be only by the human being itself so as as if it analyzes that is the society organized or inorganized why do we need government i am mean, a government to look at so we can only say these things we are democratic set up we having a democracy why we, are, we why we go for the democracy There's so much minus points are there in democracy you can only say or you can mean human being can only say not the other people so that's why your you we human being have the special capability of expression special capability of expression what is the best form of government some best government ka best form kya hai kaise government ho sakta hai just law limit of freedom uh it's very important you know what do you mean by this does law limit your freedom kanun aur kya aapki freedom ko azadi ko baandh deta hai for your benefit yes. but sometimes it is but it is for your own good aap aap aapke liye se baandh so that you should not turn into the you know crime then Does law limit of freedom? What does state of its citizen? State, state, जो है, क्या ओकर, क्या देना चाहिए, क्या दे सकते हैं? इसको अपने सिटीजन को ओ करना, उसको कुछ देना, क्या इरादा रखते हैं देने का, क्या दे सकते हैं? How could basically state अपने सिटीजन को क्या दे सकते हैं? Because you think you are. A good and uh, you know a good and respectful life, a good a job, shelter, education, medical facilities, transportation, many things are there. So state kya okay? 
क्या दे सकती है अपने सजेशन तो दैट दे कैन से यस वी आर इन दैट स्टेट एंड वन ऑफ द बेस्ट स्टेट ऑफ एनी काइंड राइट सो दिस इज कॉल्ड ह्यूमन ए ह्यूमन बीइंग ही कैन नो से दे कैन थिंक ओनली दे कैन विजुलाइज ओनली ऑल शॉर्ट ऑफ दिस एस्पेक्ट फ्रॉम द ह्यूमन ओके इट वाज द फर्स्ट पैराग्राफ why we are why we are special why human beings are unique why no other species are comparatively come to near to the near to the uh, comparatively near to the you know uh, human being at, at, at all political theory examines question of this kind and systematically think about the value that inform political life so political theory kya karti hai jo hum the first chapter par rahe hain isme maine aapko bataya ki why human being why human being the special so political theory goes inside this all theory right an examine of this kind of systematically thinks about the value that inform political life values such as freedom equality and justice look every human being wants free speech ek to ye hai na ki you know roti kapra makan is a basic thing for everyone it is a basic one but you know after that you need freedom such hmm? well they give the values we all give the values to our freedom as individual also you give the values to your freedom you don't you don't like if anyone interfere in your personal freedom personal freedom aapko bilkul acha nahi lagta jab koi aapke personal freedom may be kitna bhi close kyun na ho right so you know this is your freedom you don't you cannot barge into other so freedom is very much precious for human beings right so that's why the indian independence freedom struggle why these all freedom struggle are there when uh, you know a colony uh, make you under its subjugation jab aap aapko apni subjugation mein gulam bana leti hai then it plunder your resources and you cannot do it thing then you start your freedom struggle freedom struggle okay now this is a freedom then equality people you know they are very much conscious that no one should you know buy for it buy you give a buy this is not good everyone is equal you know you have got six fundamental rights i have my six fundamental rights the president is also having six fundamental rights and the beggar outside the temple of gurdwara he is also having a six, having the six fundamental rights so equality is there from the kanun from the law like we are all equal we are all equal. and justice nyay sabko nyay mile everyone should get the justice right so that is the answer it explains it explains a yeah, second paragraph going on it explains the meaning and significance of these and other related concept it clarifies the existing definition of these concepts by focusing on some major political thinkers of the past and present so how can you how can you think about these uh, concepts aap kaise kahenge ki freedom ka concept sabse acha hai ye ka freedom ka concept sabse acha hai aur equality ka concept sabse when many political thinkers give their views and ideas then you compare Socrates ne kya kaha, Aristotle ne kya kaha, right? Other people, uh, political theorists ne kya kaha. 
Abraham Lincoln, you know, he said that uh, democracy is the best because it's by the people, for the people, and of the people. Okay, how much is our cartoon? Nobody is responsible for this. Who is the winner in the election? He, he can form the government. Another one, second, second one is uh, the person or the party is opposition party. One is a ruling party, one is opposition party. Ruling rules the government or country and opposition party always pulls the way. Basically, to criticize the government. So that the government should not be autocratic. Right. Also, it also examines to which freedom or equality are actually present in the institution that we participate in everyday life, such as schools, shops, buses, or trains, government offices at an advanced level. It looks where the existing definitions of educate how existing institution, government, bureaucracy, and policy makers, um, policy and practices must be modified in to become more democratic. The political theory examines that no right, no right to whatever the rights you got, is it sufficient one? Or you more right? And you know, political theory gives this, this feeling also. That rights is not, not there. Rights are not only one thing. You should have your duties also. For example, today you are having lots of things from your parents. Everything, I know a lot of things. Everything from your parents. From, you know, step to step to your bike. You are depending on your parents. But tomorrow, maybe parents are depending on you. Then how do you behave? Some political theory, political concepts are also on this talk. So political theory, political theory, what they do? They visualize, they compare, they discuss, and they give you the best option. We say democracy is one of the best. But I don't think dictator, a uh, dictator from Myanmar, whosoever is, he will not say that the democracy is the best. Because he, if he says democracy is the best, next moment it would be under coup. Coup ka matlab takta palat diya jaye. Or democracy a jaye. He will never say the democracy is the best. He always say that, you know, to, to counter the corruption, to counter the dissatisfaction, we should go for the dictatorship. So, the objective underlined key the objective of political theory is to train citizens to think rationally. It's very important, you know, not, not to think rationally for your studies. You should think rationally in your daily life also. Daily life also you should think rationally. Now, what do you mean rationally? That you know, 2 plus 2 equals to 4. 4 is the result. You cannot say 5, you cannot say 3 and half, you cannot say anything. 2 plus 2 equals to 4. This is rational. But the job, whatever your work is there, you have to face the, you, you have to accept the result also. Causes are there and you have to face the consequences also. So political theory used to visualize this. The objective of political theory is to train citizens to think rationally. Aapko rationally sikhaya jaya. Kisi ki aap aise socho. Sochna is your, your point of point. How to think that's your point. But you, I'll, we always say that think positive. Okay. We, we say that think positive. So you do, if you don't think positive, then you, you will be thinking negative. Very, very smart answer. You will think negative. And when you think negative, let me tell you one thing, negative thing will happen. So why don't you go for the positive answer? 
the political theory always says that p positive p positive the objective political theory is to train citizen to think rationally about political question and assess the political even from persia in the chapter i told you two main paragraph of this chapter our we are continuing we are continuing in this chapter we will examine what is meant by politics and political theory and why we should study in this chapter we will examine what what is meant by politics politics ka kya matlab hota hai politics ka kya matlab what do you mean by politics rajniti kya hai film ka naam nahi le raha hu main rajniti kya hai we will examine what is mean by meant by politics and पॉलिटिकल थ्योरी पॉलिटिकल थ्योरी तो इतने लोगों ने पॉलिटिकल थ्योरी लिखे लोगों ने अपनी बात पॉलिटिक्स के ऊपर लिखा है इवन यू नो चाणक्य ने भी पॉलिटिक्स पढ़ाया था नालंदा यूनिवर्सिटी से क्या कहा था सम टाइम वी आल्सो नॉट इन एंड व्हाई शुड वी स्टडी हम क्यों पढ़ें व्हाई शुड वी एज अ स्टूडेंट ऑफ पॉलिटिकल पॉलिटिक्स व्हाई शुड वी स्टडी राइट What is politics? अब हमारा क्वेश्चन है वॉट इज पॉलिटिक्स वी वुड हैव नोटिस दीपल हैव डिफरेंट आइडिया अबाउट दर्ड पॉलिटिक्स पॉलिटिकल लीडर्स एंड पर्सन हु कंटेस्ट इलेक्शन एंड होल्ड पॉलिटिकल ऑफिस मे आर्ग्यू दैट इट्स अ काइंड ऑफ पब्लिक सर्विस जो थिंग सो इज दीपल Uh, at at present, I am uh, could be possible that lots of political people they are doing public service. Also, they they think that you know they the public has given lots of things to them. They should give some uh, some point back to them also. But these are very few. So it is said that we are doing public service. Some other associated politics manipulation and intrigue. Right, undertaken to pursue ambition and satisfy wants. Means, sometimes you have seen it. When a person uh, become a minister, he has nothing balance, uh, uh, some good balance in his heart, a common balance. Is there. But after some time, his balance goes up. Manipulated and many in it that goes to a uh, lack you leave lack you just come to the crowd and when he started politics when he came uh, just when he was uh, just very much new into the politics his bank balance was absolutely neglected negligible means kuch log politics ko dusron ke kaam mein laga rakha hai earlier they were they fought for the independence of india of independence of india because they want that the coming generation should be independent independent in thought in independent in expression in, in uh, independent in its work doing work it should be absolutely independent that's why they faced so much humiliation under the british So that coming generation should be satisfied. They get they for them it's a, it's a public service, mankind service, man service, mankind service, society service, country service, whatever it is. But but now society is different. This I will I will pick you up in the next. Plus, till then, take care and have a nice.